Hi there, in this video tutorial we're going to have a look at managing contacts in BT Mail. So first we need to go right to the top where it says contacts, click on that. And then if this is a menu um, just underneath it that says new contact, click on new contact and you'll get um, a list of text boxes. Um, so you can enter as much information as you like for this particular contact. Um, but I'm just going to put in some random information here. Um, so first name I'll put in Peter, last name Smith. And where it says email address, you need to put in the person's email address in this box. And this is just random information, um, it's uh, not related to me at all. Um, you have this pull down menu right next to email address, it says currently home, but if this person's email address is for something other than home like work, or you can choose your own, you just select it there. Um, if you want to uh, add another email address for this particular contact, on the right hand side you have a plus sign, if you click on that it creates another field where you're allowed to enter another email address for your contact. And if you want to remove the field, press on the minus sign and it will remove it for you. Okay, so we have our first name, last name and our email address. Um, now you need to save it. So I'll click on the diskette right at the top, it says save, click on that and it will save it there in alphabetical order. Um, under S for the last name first, Peter Smith. So we have our contact there. Um, let's say though we want to create a group. Um, so a group is useful if you want to send emails to a group of people all at once. So click on new group up the top and you'll notice on the left hand side we have to enter a uh, name for the group. I'm just going to call it group. And then to set it just press the enter key on your keyboard. So our new group is, has been created. Um, you'll notice there's nothing in the group currently. So to add to the group, click on all contacts and uh, basically find the contacts that you want to move over and left click and drag into group. And you just release the left mouse button over group there and it will make a copy of that contact for you. Click on group and you'll see the contact in there. And if you want to delete uh, a contact from the group, simply click on it first and then notice at the top it says delete and you can delete it from the group. And that works the same way if you're under all contacts, click on the contact, click on delete and also allows you to edit as well and even compose a message as well there. Okay, so now we have our contact and we have our group and I'm going to show you how we can use this um, in composing a message. So let's go to mail here and I'm going to go to compose and where it says the two box, um, if you type in the first letter of the person's name, let's see Peter Smith there and it will come up in the list here so we can use that. Um, you can also type in the name of the group if you want to send to a group. So just typing group here. Um, as you can see, it's already appeared um, as I start typing it. So you can then send to the entire group that way as well. Um, so I hope you found this tutorial useful and don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.